कास्टिंग वैक्स नाउ वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द मोस्टली यूज वैक्स इन डेंटिस्ट्री इज कास्टिंग वैक्स कास्टिंग रेस्टोरेशन आर मेड बाई लोस्ट वैक्स टेक्निक्स एग्जाम्पल ऑफ कास्टिंग रेस्टोरेशन नंबर वन पोर्सलिन फ्यूज ऑन मेटल टीथ नंबर टू कास्ट पार्शल डेंचर व्यूअर्स पिक्चर वन शो द कास्टिंग वैक्स हेयर शो द डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ डेंटल कास्टिंग वैक्सीज एंड पिक्चर नंबर टू शो द कास्ट पार्शल डेंचर कास्टिंग वैक्स इज अवेलेबल इन टू फार्म्स नंबर वन इनले वैक्स नंबर टू शीट कास्टिंग वैक्स नाउ वी विल लर्न अबाउट द बोथ वैक्सीज इन डिटेल नंबर वन इनले वैक्स वैक्स पैटर्न ऑफ कास्ट मेटल रेस्टोरेशन आर मेड इन वैक्सीज विद स्पेसिफिक प्रॉपर्टीज वीयर्स बिलो द पिक्चर यू कैन सी द इनले वैक्स एंड शीट कास्टिंग वैक्स प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ इनले वैक्स The wax are duplicate the shape and contour of desired metal casting. Number 2. The wax should be carvable and tough. Number 3. Inlay wax is available in forms of sticks of various sizes and colors. Deep blue, green, purple. Size of wax stick is 7.5 cm long and 0.64 cm diameter. Composition and chemistry of inlay wax: paraffin wax 60%, carnauba wax 20%, cerezin wax 10%, beeswax 5%, gum damer 5%. Now we will discuss about the function of all the upper discussing waxes like paraffin wax, carnauba wax, cerezin wax, beeswax, and gum damer one by one in detail. Paraffin wax. it controls the softening temperature and melting range of inlay wax carnauba wax decreases flow in paraffin wax especially at mouth temperature it gives a pleasant odor and taste increases hardness and provide a smooth glossy surface cerezin it gives plasticity to wax and adds to hardness damer it makes the wax resistance to chipping and flaking it provides a smooth and luster to wax it also make the wax tough and non brittle properties must contain inlay wax accuracy and ultimate usefulness of resulting metal casting depends on to a large degree on the accuracy of the wax pattern and its fine details Therefore the wax should permit carving to a fine margins without flaking or chipping since the wax pattern have to be melted and vaporized from investment mold at a temperature of 500 degree celsius therefore no excessive residue should be left in the mold prior to metal casting viewers given the picture you can see the inlay wax Inlay wax is further divided into two types type 1 or hard wax type 1 or hard wax is used for forming direct wax pattern in the mouth type 2 or soft wax greater flow at mouth temperature it is used in the laboratory number 2 laboratory wax should have a wide melting and softening range as it imparts more ability to the wax below softening temperature In case of type 1 wax the working temperature should be comfortable to the patient it should not be higher or it will damage the teeth type 1 and type 2 wax is must have a minimum flow of 70% and a maximum flow of 90% at 45 degree celsius to allow for proper carving of wax pattern Wax shows contraction of 0.4% when cooled from 37 degree Celsius to 24 degree Celsius. Therefore, wax has a high coefficient of thermal expansion and has a tendency to distort if allowed to stand unrestrained. Uniform heating at 50 degree Celsius for 15 minutes decreases changes of residual stress and distortion. Manipulation The wax is heated uniformly held well above flame burner to enable flow. Warm water at 54 to 60 degree Celsius provides uniform heating, but some of the constitutions 
leach out and spoil the properties of the wax. The wax cools by losing heat to air and the molecules rearrange themselves and at their original position on loss of energy. At transition point, wax loses plasticity therefore the shape cannot be changed. The wax shows cold flow. It shows thermal expansion and contraction. The wax has higher coefficient of thermal expansion and marked contraction. On cooling, therefore, small size pattern is produced. The wax pattern should be kept under constant pressure during cooling to prevent contraction. Number 2. Sheet Casting Wax It is used for making wax pattern of metallic framework of cast partial dentures. These waxes are available in form of sheet, usually of 30 gag. Dead wax is also available in ready-made shapes and bulk. Composition of sheet casting wax Number 1. Beeswax 1 part Number 2. Resin 1 part Number 3. Ceresin wax 1 part Number 4. Paraffin wax 1 part Manipulation it is used to form minimum required thickness areas of partial dentures. The wax should not be overheated. It is warmed in hot water and adopted on model. Properties of sheet casting wax Number 1. The wax has slight degree of tugginess. Number 2. The wax has some toughness and strength. Number 3. It vaporizes without leaving any residue. Number 4. It is highly ductile. Number 5. It is readily adaptable at 40 to 45 degrees Celsius. Viewers, if you like this video, please don't forget to thumb up, subscribe and share. See you in next video. Allah Hafiz.